Little bit of a different objective guide today. Usually we do individual player objectives, but today we're going to put them together. And this is how to complete Sane and Prince Boateng in the same, I guess, set of games, if you will, at the same time. I thought instead of me recording a video for Sane explaining how to do him, I've been doing Boateng and saying in both individual videos that you can do them together, I may as well just do one big video for this morning and say how to do both of them at the exact same time. If you guys are still confused after this, make sure to let me know. But it's pretty self-explanatory. Let's start off with Leroy Sane. You need to assist six goals in squad battles on at least semi-pro difficulty rivals or foot champs. Score five using a player from the Bundesliga. Score and assist in three separate matches using a German player. Score at least two goals in three separate matches whilst having at least three German players in your starting 11 and win seven matches on at least semi-pro rivals or foot champs. So for Sane, the notable squad requirement here is at least three German players. You do need Bundesliga goals, but the big notable requirement is at least three German players. Now we head on over to Boateng, who was assist seven goals in squad battles on at least semi-pro or rivals champ, same as Sane. This time using a player from the Serie A. You got score five goals using a player from the Premier League. Okay, now these are not in separate matches, so you could get this done in a single squad battles game if you wish. Get the five goals with a Prem player, assist seven with a player from the Serie A. You got score using a forward and assist using a midfield during two separate matches. Now, this one is pretty easy. You got a score using a striker, um, a striker, right wing, left wing, center forward, is what a forward is classified as, all right? Um, I think that's, I think I covered all of the forwards. Then you need to assist with a midfielder being a cam, center mid, CDM, left mid, or a right mid. It is the position on the card, by the way. For example, if you play a left wing off cam as a left mid, he'll count as a left wing. If you go into the game and the card says a left mid, an LM, he'll count as a midfielder. Vice versa, go into the game and his card says LW, he'll count as an attacker, okay? So the midfielder, forward, whatever, is referring to that position on the, the card, not the position that he plays in game, okay? Uh, now you've got score three finesse goals and win seven using at least three Bundesliga players. So what we can do is get three German Bundesliga players, the three Bundesliga players in your starting lineup for Boateng, the three German in your starting lineup for Leroy Sane, all right? And you can just do three German Bundesliga players, that's easy. Then you need a CDR player to get assists with and a Premier League player to get the five goals with. It's, it's pretty easy. So when it comes to the squad builder, boys, this is my main team right now. Your guys' team may be looking completely different or it may be looking the same. Now, this is perfect. We can use this reserves bench as our work area, if you will, for the sake of the video. Now, we need three German players, German Bundesliga players to be precise. Now, in my club, I've really only got Nabry. I've not got much great players here, so I'll just choose a goalkeeper as well. We shouldn't really struggle with this because it is going to be in squad battles, all right? Now, you can do it in rivals or champs if you wish. If you do want to do it in rivals or foot champs, you definitely don't want to be using silvers. So what I'd recommend doing is going German Bundesliga, going to this player quality special and the max buy now of 15,000 coins. And then you can pick up some players from the market, a Brandt, you can get a Goetze, you can get a Schlotterbeck, all right? If you're doing it online, you'll definitely want to spend 30 40 000 coins if you don't have anyone to get good players that can actually compete but once i'm doing it in squad battles it's completely fine if i use absolutely ass players because i should not struggle on semi-pro difficulty despite having these players so that's the three german bundesliga players we need a cdr player uh, to get the assist with so preferably an attacker we'll go for mkhitaryan and we also need a premier league player all right we need a premier league player to get five goals with once again for Boateng, preferably an attacker let's go for jj okocha so you'll just be choosing players in your club it may be completely different players to the players that i've got on my bench here now i'm not going to muck up my whole squad and get all these players in but it's self-explanatory nabry you can go ahead you'd probably want to position modify him to make him a right wing so he can count as a forward um and also get chemistry depending on the formation i'd get nabry in i'd get muller in i'd get my goalkeeper in now what you can do is you can decide if you want to start your premier league and your cdr player or you can simply put them on the bench and you can pause your squad battles game straight away and sub them on and just get those five premier 
Premier League goals and 7 Serie A assists and if you can get that in the same match then you don't have to worry about the Serie A and Prem objectives again alright it's as simple as that a Serie A player a Premier League player three German Bundesliga players that's all you need preferably you want one of the German Bundesliga players to be an attacker because for Sane you do need to score goals with Bundesliga players obviously just be easier scoring those goals with an attacker as mentioned personally i'd probably do these in squad battles but it depends on the player quality you've got maybe you could do squad battles just to get the cdr assists and the bundesliga goals and maybe if you want to do a few squad battle matches and then you can do the rest in rivals or foot champs that is a brilliant shout in my opinion that's probably the most efficient way but with squad battles what i'd recommend doing and this is the squad battles tip now every single selection you get given four teams in this case we've got two very poor teams which is beautiful a 65 with 15 chem a 68 with 14 chem we choose the lowest difficulty we possibly can which is semi-pro and would be able to obliterate these two teams here we should be able to get all of the cdr assists and premier league goals done obviously with the free german and free bundesliga players they will also count as a couple games towards the progress and after that i will circle it you can update your opponents using square if you're on the playstation or x if you are on xbox and you can update play the worst team it's roughly a 15 minute cooldown before you can use the refresh feature again but you can play a poor team refresh play a poor team refresh that way it will just be an absolute breeze you can chuck on a film score 10 goals and a half put the controller down for the second half and you'll just blitz through these objectives in no time or as i said you could do maybe two or three squad battle games get all, all of the annoying objectives out the way then do the remainder in rivals or champs that's up for you to decide so for the recap, we'll start off with Sane, assist 6 goals will come naturally, score 5 goals using a player from the Bundesliga, score an assist in 3 separate matches using a German player, once again this is why I recommend using a German Bundesliga player and using one of them as an attacker, in my case it would be Nabry, that way for Sane scoring 5 and also getting goals and assists, score at least 2 in 3 separate matches, now this can be with anyone, you just need at least 3 Germans in the starting 11 and win 7 matches, so that's pretty easy, it's just 7 goals using a player from Serie A and score 5 from a player with a Prem, you can either start your Serie A in Prem player or you can have them on a the bench, sub them on and then you can be done with them after you get the goals and assists. Assist, score using a forward and assist using a midfielder will just come naturally and you've got score free finesse goals once again will come naturally it is r1 plus shoot or right bumper plus shoot if you're on xbox to score a finesse shot and lastly win seven with at least three players from bundesliga yeah, and you're starting 11 lads any questions make sure to let me know hopefully this helped you out two objective guides in one but i thought it'd be a missed opportunity if i just did them individually this is without a doubt the best quickest and i mean that's it the, the best and quickest way to do it it's been your boy davis and i'll see you guys in the next one peace out